Last season, I decided kind of on a whim to go for rank 1 US West for a video, but in the process, I accidentally overshot the elo range and messed up the recording. So to make it up to you all, I'm going to try again this season and see how far we can get. Apologies in advance if the gameplay is a bit uh, slower than usual and stuff like that. I, I don't know, I've been playing a lot of Slap City recently, haven't really been putting too much time into Brawlhalla because I'm in preparation for Nick All-Star Brawl, which came out yesterday. Great game, by the way. Definitely going to make videos on it. Having a ton of fun with that. Uh, I did have one warm-up game against Meggy, though, so hopefully I should be back into the groove of things pretty soon here, or pretty quickly here, rather. Got that edge guard right there. Playing a lot of Zul today uh, in remembrance that Shrek was not the last announced character in Smash, unfortunately. Uh, I guess Sora is cool too. I never played Kingdom Hearts, but let's just do a gameplay commentary because we are shooting for rank one. Don't want to get too off topic here. Got this uh, early stock lead here. Yeah, three piece combo kind of hurting. That's already like, what, like 40 damage or something like that. So I don't want to take too many of those. I am Zol though. So honestly, every hit I get is worth a lot. That barely missed me by a hair. Honestly, I thought that might hit with my spacing. All right, they went for it again. So I'm just going to do a, a dodge downwards so that I can get a punish with the cannon. Cannon is definitely my weaker weapon of the two, but because it's kind of, you know, it's, it's cannon, you can cheese out a lot of kills or, or a lot of hits that people might not be expecting. Oh, I tried to GC sidelight again because I, okay, case in point there. In Slap City, maybe I can up beat that. <laughs> yeah, my uh, my movement is not quite as precise, but yeah, it, no no excuse. I got to get back into the groove of things one way or another. So trial by fire, and uh, I forgot what I was saying anyway. Yeah, I tried to GC sidelight that one, but then I misinputted. Ooh, that was a good dodge. All right, with Axe here, I'm gonna be looking primarily for side air and for uh, end light to KO bit rushing or i'm rushing a bit but still able to clean that one out and i'm gonna pick up the cannon here again cannon although it is my weaker one like i mentioned you can get some early damage and and kind of push people in the corner put them in weird spots where they might not be used to and get some yeah like big strings like that with the axe for example maybe i can get that but it'll still be an in individual hits as opposed to one interaction like the cannon now if i'm a better cannon player i side here there because it'll be a true combo but i, I guess weapon throws work too now this is the struggle with being a US West because the ladder is quite small. I was only able to get three ELO from that game and rank one I think is about 2468. So uh, quite a ways to go, but I'm willing to make the trek. All right, we got a Taros now. There's honestly not much that's scarier than queuing into a Taros in ranked. So I'm just gonna uh, hope that I don't take too many unnecessary hits there. That's a dodge in. Oh, I gotta scope that one out for next time. And then a dodge up there as well. Very, very poor GC on my part. Also a poor Sayer was just trying to get right back into the action. Hopefully I can get a read on their movement or, or the things that they like to do pretty soon. That was an all or nothing Sayer. And then I saved them in the process. What am I doing? Nick all stars brawl. I get an air dash there and I make it back. Okay, that's, that's, that's what I was thinking. All right, well, there's nothing much scarier than going down to an early lead in a Taros and ranked. So let's clean things up here. Yeah, that, that spot dodge, I should have weighed that one out. Gone for an end light or something. All right, there's the dodge in. I'm so lucky they missed. Oh my God. All right, I'm going to go deep here. They're going to recovery. I missed because I'm a bad gamer. Oh God, this is a terrible start to this video. Okay, okay, okay. Got the cleanup stock. I'm going to keep the ax here because they're going to pick up hammer. That's a matchup that I tend to like. Well, I'm kind of short on breath here. Yeah, I'm, I'm a bit nervous. <laughs> I don't know. All right, we're going to go up recovery and I miscalculated. They picked up the ax anyway. Okay, that's fine. Axe ditto. Just got to get some early aerials here, maybe. Ooh, that was some good tricky movement. Poor dodge on my part. I am rushing quite a bit, but yep. Looks like they're going to fish for this kill. I just got to avoid Sarah. I got to avoid Enlight, and I got to avoid down sig primarily. Okay, this is a really bad spot to be. If I down air there, I knew they were going to go below me with hammer. So if I just down air, if I had the cognizance, the wherewithal to do that, uh, I would be in a much better spot. But all right, that's the dodge in again. I didn't punish it, but... Again, this matchup is one that I like. You can kind of float above, land those dares, get below them, land those end lights. That's the dodge out. Weapon toss, not quite. All right, I lost my weapon here, so I'm just going to be guarding this lip. They're probably going to stare to come back or something like that. Dodge in. Okay, keep them in this corner. With unarmed, you really can't edge guard hammer in that scenario straight up because the recovery will just beat what you're trying to do. So covering this lip of the stage is pretty good. Ha uh, cannon's kind of a similar deal, but if I jump down, maybe I can get one of those down airs, or if I suck, then I get hit. But I did touch the wall, so I should be fine. Yep, should be okay. And clean that one up. Okay, not the worst scenario in the world. Not great, but uh, still doable, still winnable. I am quite a few hits uh, away from, or only a few hits away from death here. And uh, I got quite a few to come back, but I believe in myself. I can do it. Wake up attack. They wake up attack again. Looks like they like to do that a lot. I'm going to hop to this platform here. Don't want to run out of jumps. Caught that dodge. They didn't, they didn't fast fall there. I thought they might fast fall. Okay, get this down light. Maybe peek in the side air. They're looking for the axe. Looks like that is their primary weapon of choice here. Land with that side air. Any recovery? Oh my goodness. Okay, that was quite the stressful game. Nine elo. All right, I'll take it. I will take it. 
I don't know if I mentioned this, but to give you an idea of where my head's been at in the, uh, the Brahala sphere, the Brahala space, this is the last day of the rank season and I'm doing this. Probably not the best timing there, bit of a procrastinator. I, I didn't even know it was the last day until someone posted in my Discord last night saying, oh, I only have one more day to, to get diamond. And I was like, oh, okay, wait, maybe I should make this video. Nick All-Stars is fun, okay? I like SpongeBob, he's, he's a lot of fun. Cat Dog is also pretty broken, you know, all that stuff. Anyway, back to the game here. Against this spear, I really want to avoid the big combo starters like that one, big string starters and then on the ground here they can't really kill me too easily so with axe i do have a bit of an advantage because i can get that end light out i missed the downer they missed the downer all right it's 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 fine we're in the clear i'm gonna juggle this one up delay the weapon spawn it's gonna pick up this axe once more since it seemed pretty effective uh in neutral against this player right here are they gonna go for the weapon they went for an extra hop and a dodge there that was pretty good if i did catch that dodge it would have been dangerous but i didn't catch it because you know it faked me out all right, early recovery. No early recovery. I missed my cider by just a hair. If I fast fold that one, it would have been better. But with Kaya, I'm not too worried about getting knocked out super early here. So I'm just going to go high. And I can look out for those uh, those grounded killing options like the downlight as well as the signatures. Uh, and after that, I'm not too worried. They're, they might go high here. I'm going to go for an end sig. Wrong way, but still the right idea. They didn't down air a second time. Going to catch an early high recovery. And ground. Okay, that ground pound was a bit antsy. I will admit. They got antsy on their ground pound though, so it's okay. We're kind of mirroring each other. Mirror match. There's the down air went for the side sig all right now i'm gonna pick up the cannon because it is uh i only have a little bit of health left and i haven't used it yet so it might mix them up i might be able to cheese out some early damage if they're not expecting things i'm gonna go for dodge in no dodge in there all right that was a spot dodge got that one there oh okay not a dodge in there either all right my reads were totally wrong somehow i didn't get hit by that down sig uh, i'm thinking my lucky stars about that one gonna toss that up go for a high recovery again with spear they're gonna primarily want to kill me in the air or with the signature on the ground i have that side sig i saw that one coming so i'm just gonna wait that one out and my side air i started up just a bit too slow i knew that down light was coming so i was thinking i'm gonna side air beat it out i did not but i still have a good amount of a lead here so let's see catch a landing nope they went the other way that's a-okay gonna go here i don't know why every ranked video i just started saying a-okay it's like my filler word because i'm just trying to trying to focus oh, i was trying to down sig there like uh like this but did not did not pan out probably shouldn't do it again that wasn't just a demonstration don't try it at home all right here i'm just gonna go wide because now they have to work i don't want to talk about it that's fine i it, it was so guaranteed too and i still missed uh okay i'm gonna do that again where i bait them out and then okay second time's the charm Miss Dare aside, I am slowly getting back into the swing of things, hopefully. I mean, we'll see how this game goes. Well, they just hopped over my downlight with that, uh, with that downlight. That was kind of in interesting. Pretty sick, pretty sick nasty. It's like the Emperor's New Groove, you know? I gotta get the groove back. I don't, I don't remember that movie. Kronk, wrong lever. That's that, that's that movie, right? That film, that piece of media, cinema. That was a pretty lucky weapon toss, I will admit. That's also the advantage of cannon. Its weapon toss is insane. I'm gonna pick it up again because it seemed like I was uh, doing well with it. I mean, it's not like I did much, but I did well. <laughs> so, you know, gotta take the date, whatever data you can get. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go for an instant air there. Instant air there was not the right idea. If they ground pounded, I'd probably get hit, but that's okay. I'm missing true combos. Everything I just said about the new groove, I take it back. Ground pound there is the option, or down air or something. Maybe weapon toss down. All right, they didn't fa fall down. Got like ground pound. That almost KO'd. That's the power of Zol, I suppose. Did I just save them? Okay, no, we're good. We're good. My gameplay is a mess today. I am so sorry. I, I hope it's enjoyable at the very least. I'm not enjoying it. No, I am enjoying it. I I'm lying. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be playing if I wasn't enjoying it. Oh, okay. They didn't insta jump. That was a good move. Oh, axe ground pound is uh, quite the move. What? What? Um... I'm not enjoying myself. I thought I had another jump I'd be able to downlight into down air, okay? Maybe I did have another jump, but I wasn't paying attention. Who knows? Who kn at this point, really, who knows? This is where I start to uh, start to slip away, start to crumble mentally, so let's uh, let's not have that happen. We're gonna do a side light or a down sig, and I still fell into it. God, this is, this is not, this is, <laughs> okay, 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 close the curtains. We're, we're good, it's over. Next. Maybe I'm being too self-critical. Maybe I should be nicer to myself. I, I don't know. Either way, I'm waiting in queue like four times the length of these games, which is like, I, I'm so glad I decided not to do this on stream because that would not make for the best. Yeah, you know, I, I could just cut it out here and stream. I would have to fill that time by talking to chat, which, you know, they've been bullying me recently. So I, I don't know if I'd want to subject myself to that. I backdashed there instead of forward dash by accident. I couldn't get an attack out. All right, here with this platform, this changes things up a little bit because the axe juggling, they can land on the platform, but I can also land on the platform which is really nice that end sig was a bit risky risque Ooh, all right they fell there i wasn't able to get the punish but this i wasn't able to get the punish and it was intentional so that i could catch the dodge so i could land this and then uh land this one 
in the next interaction. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna interrupt that one. Come high here. They might go wide, so I'm gonna fake wide and then, yep, come back in so that they think that I'm gonna try and go out to the end of the platform when in reality, I'm still got my eyes, I don't know, trained on that little corner there. Missing strings, missing combos, but at the very least I can make decisions. So, <laughs> okay, too self-critical. Go up, go high. Another recovery so I don't get caught out by the bow. They don't have the range to hit me there unless they GC, but I don't think they had a dodge. Ooh, okay, thinking my lucky stars there. I'm gonna go up. Weapon toss again. This weapon toss seems very effective off stage, so I'm gonna keep using it. I thought I'd pick up the axe there. And so it still would have covered a similar area. Now just catch their landing. Downlight. Okay, we're fine. They're gonna go first. I um I got red. Is what that was. And uh there's nothing I could have done in that situation, I think. Uh, that one either so it's a matter of uh understanding when you're in control of the situation and when you're not and uh making the most of it pretty much the queue times really are killing me here I, I feel like i'm gonna finish this video by the time the heat death of the universe happens but maybe i'm just an impatient kiddo maybe it's actually not that long and my perception of time has been skewed all right that's a dodge in gonna scope that one out for next time did not scope it out for next time they didn't dodge in there but maybe it's off a scenario like this no nope, no dodge there well it also makes sense i'm not close to them so a lot of baiting out dodges you want to make them think that you're gonna go for the punish like that for example although i didn't mean to actually attack there kind of fat finger that one but yeah you want to make them think that you're going to attack them and then and then, and then you don't that way okay well that was i thought that would be better timing but then you can uh, bait some bait something out bait out an option here all right let's uh let's not get too fatigued let's just get some down lights catch an end light catch a landing that'll get a knockout and there we go axe end light is just such a good move the active hitboxes the priority the ko power it's a 10 out of 10 all right now let's uh unarmed against axe is not the greatest position i'm just gonna do a quick juggle move here i can be houdini and maybe go off stage catch with side air got a bit of a rollback that's okay i was a bit slow that's all that means uh, i read that one but i maybe should have down aired oh, i'm so lucky they didn't ground pound i probably was dead because i didn't have jumps now on the lance here their main ko options is going to be like side air and then signatures so i just got to watch out for those not get caught by a side air side light isn't too much of a worry because it can't ko me more damage, more damage is good. That's not going to knock out, but it's fine. They're going to jump up, maybe dodge up. No, they didn't dodge up. They dodged through. That's fine. Maybe they go for a ground pound. Yep, high risk ground pound on the lance. But either way, they're still one hit away from being knocked out. So I'm not too worried here. Maybe if I GC end light, that still hits. Yeah, like look at all that damage buildup. It just means that getting the knockout, like I can land a down light and still KO. A side air will definitely KO. And uh, even though I'm not getting the knockout, I'm not getting like nervous or anything. I'm not stressing out because I know that I'm just setting myself up for the next hit, really. And that's what a lot of Axe play is about, is you can't really get that true combo to KO, but you can get some other stuff to build up damage so that a single hit can do it. And that's a, uh, yeah, it's a good thing to keep in mind. Maybe a dodge. That move is insane. All right, we're at 2441 so far. Still quite a ways to go, but I can see it. I can see the end. I feel like at the start of all these games, I have to re-acclimate my brain, re-climatize to playing against humans because the, the bots in the free-for-all queue, let me tell you, they do things a little differently. All right, they don't press buttons. <laughs> they, they don't dodge. All right, let, let, let's, let's, get this, uh, let's get this done here. Last time on this map against Taros, it didn't go the best. So let's try and make up for that. See if uh, the warm-up helps at all. That is quite a risky move and it paid off because I did not punish it. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't ground pound there. They're, they got more priority. Maybe going for the weapon there isn't the best idea. Maybe I should chase, but picking up the axe I feel like is pretty good in this scenario, in this red scenario. All right, they dodged into the wall. I don't want to get recovery there. Maybe a high side air. Nope. All right, I'm going to try and end light them as they come back to the stage here because they might just hover around with those nares and I don't really have a move. Unless I space it properly, that can contest it. But if I do that, then uh, I'll give them the space to come back to stage, which I don't want to do. I'm going to keep playing the cannon here. It seemed pretty effective in the first dock. So let's just continue that, uh, that damage train if possible. That's a dodge up. Very good dodge against cannon because you can't get one of those extreme extended strings, although you still can get uh, if you read it properly. Yep, that's another dodge up all right next time i think i'll do a gc side light to catch that that's the third end sig and the zeroth that i've punished all right they're gonna come up to stage now and my spacing is not good uh that's okay all right not gonna punch that one either that one is just because i didn't have the brain uh i guess in the other ones i still technically didn't have the brain um shouldn't have jumped there uh if i knew they were going for that but still okay <laughs> i had to think about my spacing for a sec you saw the gears turning 
All right, they're gonna try and drop down the stage, hit, uh, hit a down sig. I almost said end sig again, but yeah, that's that's the primary terrorist kill move. Let's see if they down air. They didn't down air, um, but tossing a couple weapons there, obstacle course, bit difficult to avoid, and I luckily get another kill there where maybe I shouldn't have uh, shouldn't have gotten that too quickly. But I'm gonna look. Uh, okay, I was gonna say I'm gonna look out for downlight here, and then I instantly got hit by it. Should have been looking more carefully. Clearly, all right, early damage. No, my punishes this game have not been the greatest uh, on the end sigs and stuff, but hopefully I can still read the movement. I I read the movement and, and yeah, I said I was gonna GC sidelight, I GC downlighted, whoops. All right, they're gonna push to the corner. They seem to overextend a lot with attack, so I can uh, maybe catch some of those. Uh, oh, I don't wanna be unarmed against the, the hammer here. Cider, all right, that's an air. Not the greatest jump cider on my part. I thought they were gonna jump in, uh, so just a poor read. But some early damage, some catch and dodges and stuff. Although I haven't been able to punish moves, uh, I've at the very least been able to punish some certain, certain dodges, Jesus. And, uh, and get some KOs that way, so, all right. Bit of a trap there, they avoided it, and, uh, oh, and I missed. It's fine, it was intentional, gotta get the damage. Damage is more important. Damage is 100% more important. All right, never mind. <laughs> my, uh, my punishes are more important. I really don't want to have to split this into two separate videos, but at this current rate, I'm gonna have to play 11 straight more games just to get uh, in the range. So that might end up happening, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. You know, mathematics, not my strongest suit. Up against this Orion once again. I didn't really play the cannon too much last game, so I'll see if I can do that this one. Doing that for the damage, I don't think I can KO because I didn't have my dodge for the downline into NSIG, or at least I didn't think I did. Maybe I did. All right, gonna land a side air though. I, I thought they might go to the right or drift to the right, so I did that side air. Luckily, I didn't get punished. Here, I'm gonna do a dash back. Oh, too slow on the trigger. I was gonna do a dash back and then side air to catch them trying to stare back to the stage. Luckily, they misspaced their uh, recovery just a little bit and I was able to do it. Yeah, let's play some cannon. Cannon to Lance is not a great matchup for me. I pretty much only dare. So maybe I should uh, maybe I should play that in this game to learn it a little more. Yeah, they're gonna go for that one because they went for that last game. I uh, oh they saved me. Okay, okay, that weapon toss was insane. I, I it trapped me. I was I was done. It was it was over. But I, I appreciate the uh, the help there. Okay, they're gonna land maybe with a ground pound, a down air. Yeah, that stair was quite rushed. I will say down light. Are they gonna down light right away? Maybe side air. Ah, oh, I thought I got my dodge in out in time, but I did not unfortunately. And now. I'm gonna pick up an axe here as it falls down. Good weapon spawn for me. Thank you, RNG, I appreciate it. All right, they're pushing themselves to the corner there. I'm gonna hold this one because I thought they may uh, it might track their movement because Spear doesn't have the fastest upward hitting move. So if I can get that out and they try and contest it, I'll be able to punish. All right, I'm gonna dodge in there. Not my greatest dodge in, but the reason why I did that is so that if they tried to downlight me off stage, I would have been able to dodge in and get an end light out. Oh, poor spacing once again on that side air, but you can see the idea at the very least. I'm trying to space just outside it so I can punish and gonna pick up this cannon. Although it kind of doomed me in the last stock and I would have died super early off stage. I think still good to practice a matchup that you're not too good in. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna catch an early dodge there. Maybe I should have nared probably. Yeah, this is what I mean. Like I kind of just jump above them and dare. <laughs> like I, I'm not sure what else to do. I gotta lab it out more. Not even lab it out more. I just need more practice is what it is, but I'm not too good at avoiding all the moves. And that's that GC sidelight that I was trying to talk about in the tarot scheme. Low uh, weapon toss there. Wow, that's gonna take the stock. Nice. All right, we'll do one last game here and then pick it up in the next session. Trust me, I, I, I mean, I've got to do it today. So it's going to be just I'm gonna take maybe a 15 minute break because I've only got less than 12 hours left to get this rank one if I want to. So just going to play up against this Cassie on Miami Dome. This is a pretty good map for Axe because you can get those platform extensions and cover it with Nair and stuff. This music. All right, nice. It was a bit, bit much for me. I don't know if I've experienced the dome uh, soundscape yet in this uh, in this session. Maybe I have. I, I, I can't remember, but all right. Gonna pick up the cannon. Uh, cannon Dare is super good against guns because it has that 45 degree angle, kind of similar to how it's good against Lance. And then that end light is really good for getting in close, uh, punishing and hit stacked and all that. So oh, got faked out there with movement. Didn't get the dare that I wanted, but that down sig is just so good. It can cover so much space, even uncharged. Uh, it's a pretty good option. Now I'm gonna pick up the, uh, the axe. Like I mentioned earlier, axe into hammer is a matchup that I feel pretty comfortable in uh, not gonna get that punished there that covers a bunch of dodges didn't get the right ones that time but that's okay I didn't get punished for it and that weapon toss okay <laughs> that was a bit risky for me to pick that one back up but all right let's see are they gonna ground pound down light on the ledge maybe side sig okay one for a side light and I uh, I didn't quite punish it but at the very least I didn't die and honestly that's still a win in my book <laughs> if, I don't, if I don't die even if I don't get the punish that's okay all right they went for a side sig there looks like uh, my side light there poor spacing I thought I'd be able to catch that movement but was not and sig barely missing as well. I'm gonna go for this down sig once again, cover a bunch of space there. They fell under it, that was good movement, but I'm able to catch them as they used a bunch of options to avoid me. Uh, now I'm gonna pick up the cannon because I think they're gonna get guns, if I'm not mistaken. 
Uh, let's see, dodge in, yep, and they got the guns once more. So guns are gonna be looking on Cassidy for that side sig for a downlight as well. Right, let's see if I can get a string. Yeah, they can jump out of that one. Also, if they have dodge, they can jump, uh, dodge out of it, so gotta be careful about that. My string, oh my goodness. Okay, that was a bullet of a, of a toss, which I guess makes sense, and the logically wise. Um, all right, weapon toss again. They recovered earlier than I thought. Let's see, they might rush this kill because it seems like they've been going for a lot of signatures down there, and I'm able to catch that with the cannon. All right, well, this push to rank one so far, 2001 Neil. Yeah, that's quite the difference. It's, uh, yeah, it's because of those cues. All right, that was a pretty fun session. We climbed quite a bit. I'm gonna take like a 15 minute break. I'll see you in the next one, and hopefully we'll be able to get rank one pretty soon.